In this video, you are going to learn how to add the titles in Premiere Pro. Coming up. Hi everyone, I am Harshwardhan from harshwardhanar.com. Welcome to another superb episode. In this episode, we are going to learn the different ways of adding the titles to your footage in Premiere Pro. Adding title is a very important and essential part of video editing because without adding titles, your project would be incomplete. So in this episode, we are going to learn how to add the titles in the Premiere Pro 2018. If you're using the 2015 version of the Premiere Pro, there was only one option of the legacy titles. But after the 2015 version in 2017, they have introduced the essential graphics panel, which is over here. And here you have some pre-made titles which you can click and drag and drop so these are drag and drop option but i'm going to show you both the ways i will show you the legacy title how to use legacy titles and how to use this essential graphics panel which is over here so let's get started so in order to add the new title you need to go to the file select new and from here you will see this option legacy title which is over here just click over that and this would open up this dialog box so from here it would automatically choose your resolution of the project or the footage so at this moment it's 1920 by 1080 you can decide the frame rate as well but it automatically just matches with your project only and here you can give it a title name if you want to if I want I just keep it default so I'll just press ok and thereafter it's going to open up this legacy title option which is over here you can see this new dialog box would be open you can click and drag it to make it re or resize it to fit in the view if you want to see it clearly and now here you have all these tools so here we have the move tool rotate tool selection tool and vertical type tool and all these so using all these you can create these shapes as well so using all of these you can just create your title so let me show you i can click anywhere and then type this is title okay and here we have some presets you can see you can click anywhere of this and that would give you this style option so if i click anywhere you can see immediately your title would be converted into this style or this style would be applied on your title so you can do that as well and the, on the right side we have some options we can adjust its opacity we can adjust its position we can adjust its weight height and using all of this you can even change the font style like if you want to make it some other font like let's see Babus new so i can just press enter and from here you can choose the phone style whether you want it the regular bold or anything else and you can see the this style or this font has now been changed you can adjust the font size from here you can change its aspect if you want to and you can adjust leading kernel tracking there are different options which you can do you can make them small caps or you can slant them as well slant the title you can adjust anything if you want you can place the underline under it and here we have the option of fill so if you want to change the color of this at the moment the white is selected you can click and choose any color you want and press ok or you can click on this eyedropper menu and click anywhere on the and it's going to pick the color from there all right so if i want to make it red or something like this so this is how you can add the title if you want to add more one of more then you can click once again and this is subtitle okay and thereafter you can change its style as well to anything you like and again we have the option if you want to add the background suppose if you don't want your title to be applied on your footage as a transparent title or transparent background you can choose the background option from here so you can click and that's going to add the background so you can change the color of the background as well at the moment it's black so you can click 
and you can choose the white and that's going to add the white background if you want to make it let's say green and that's going to add a green title so and if you want to adjust its alignment so you can just select this one and come over here you can choose the left alignment center alignment of the text or left alignment of the text or you can if you want to align it just come over here on this option to align so you can center it center the title and center from the vertical center from the horizontal you can do the similar thing with this as well you can manually click and drag it anywhere you like select both of these click this way click center and your title would be perfectly centered and suppose if you want to add some shape over here i'm just going to remove the background and let's say i select this rectangle tool and i just click and draw a rectangle like this okay and if i want more want to move it to the background i would right click and select transform or arrange and select bring to or send to back so that way this rectangle would, would be in the background and title would be over here and thereafter once you are happy just close it and this is your title you can click and drag it anywhere on your footage and this title would be applied and at this moment it's very ugly title i have not designed it well i'm just showing you how it works all right and then we have some essential graphics panel where we have some preset titles so these are like if you want to add the credit just click and drag it anywhere and here you will see lots of credits film credits which come at the end of uh, movies or video so if you want to change any of these just come over here on the edit option click any of these and then you need to press the T for type tool and select that and change it and this is very tiny so I'll show you some other title so let me just delete it browse if essential graphics panel which is over here if not shown to you just go to the windows and select the essential graphics option make sure this one is checked only then it would be visible over here so let me just show you this uh, simple one maybe that's this one so let me click and drag it over here so now you can see this is added so i'm just going to select this one and here we have the option all of those legacy options which are over here so we can do the same thing we can edit our title anything we want so now let me just change it so let me select this one Control A to select it and then change it. This is the title. All right. So you can ju just type anything you want, and if you want to roll it, you can just do that as well. And in the edit, let me show you. If you want to make it larger, you can just make it larger and if you want to change any color of this just choose the color here we have the option of shadows so if you want you don't want the shadows just uncheck it if you want a stroke click over here and that's going to add the stroke and you can adjust the stroke value as well and we have whole bunch of option and these are simple text options which you will find in almost any word program like if you have ever used the microsoft word so these are basically the same thing and you can adjust them and create beautiful titles and in these title panel or essential graphics panel you will find some titles which require you to have the after effects and they would work only if you have the after effects installed otherwise they will not work so these are some of let me show you okay so something like this 
so gaming background like this one so i'll click and drag it over here this title called the gaming intro these are very heavy titles because they are interlinked with the after effects and they were actually created in after effects and now they have been pre-installed over here so i'll just cancel this option and here we have the option of changing if suppose i want to change this text so these are very easy to change the text just select the title and just type uh, my game and select if you want to play just change it to anything else you want and here we have the option of animation speed direction angle and here we can change the color of this as well so if you want to change the color of the highlight of the logo click over here let's select this one and it's going to be applied immediately click here change this to this and this would be applied and subtitle color if you want to change it just change it all right so this is how you can just customize this option or these titles which are essential graphics panel the titles which are pre-installed over here which are very limited and they are also not that good and in the next video i will show you how you can install the premium essential graphic templates or premium essential graphics titles for your project and you can purchase that premium pack which has lots of lots of beautiful professionally made titles which are very easy to use and that gives your project a amazing professional look so in the next video i will show that so thank you so much i hope you have enjoyed this episode if you did hit the like button if you did not like the video hit the dislike button if you have any question or if you want to say something leave that in the comment section below and if you have not subscribed to this channel please consider subscribing to subscribe just click the big red button below this video and don't forget to click the bell icon as well that way you won't miss any new video from this channel